Arizona man spent a week in the hospital recovering from a flesh eating bacteria. He believes he was infected while visiting a popular spot where families go to beat the heat. Carissa Planpulp has the story. As you can see, it tore up my hands a lot. Like. His skin is still peeling. The swelling in his thigh has gone down. And they're using this little vacuum thing right here to keep it sealed up. Jonathan Daggett had to be rushed into surgery. The diagnosis of flesh eating bacteria. It sounds like some stuff off of like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles or something, you know, some mutant X-Men type things. Uh. Jonathan believes he got the potentially deadly infection at a splash pad. Well, it goes through the circulation, shoots up, water gets in your mouth, water gets in your eyes. Killing it with chlorine, not as easy as you think. It would be so unpleasant for you to swim in if you put in that much chlorine, okay? It would be unpleasant for your eyes, the fumes would bother you. To protect yourself from getting infected, treat and cover up cuts and scrapes. If I probably could have caught it a little quicker, I probably wouldn't be here. It's impossible to know exactly how Jonathan got the flesh eating bacteria, but he wants others to know when something is wrong, see a doctor immediately. Some people come out as amputees, like my leg could have been cut off. So it could have been a lot worse. And that was Carissa Planop reporting. The city that runs the splash pad Jonathan visited said that what comes out of the spout is clean tap water.